Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4. It's happened again. Uh, for the second time, we have conquered Lubeck. And this time, we intend to keep it. Um, so yeah, Siege of Lubeck is over. Um, do I peace out immediately with them? With that, they may not accept them every too many allies in the war, but try to get them to peace out and give you Lubeck and all of their money. Okay, so, super peace. Give me Lubeck, which they will take. Yes, it's, it's green, be that. <laughs> Do it right. Um, treaties. Oh, not treaties, because they won't exist, but just give me all their money. Yeah. They will not give me all their money. They do, however, have a shit ton of money. Yep. 1,287. Nice. Um, is there any way to get to the number where they will... No, there isn't. How annoying. Um, are they above 100? Uh, so they won't give it to you. 130. Uh, no. Then you just have to lower it down to 100. Lower it down to 100. Wow, this is going to be a lot of money. <laughs> More money than I've ever seen. <laughs> 729. Uh, nice. So, we demand the full good. annexation. Good. They pay us 729. Uh, we get 381 of that. And I get the other half. Yep. Excellent. Sounds that good. Sounds very good. Send demand. And this should complete our... Um... Okay. Danish conquest of Riga. Excellent. I get money. Excellent. Okay. Uh, trade trade league disbanded as well. Yep. Which can only be good news for, for my trade ambitions. Hey, and we get Baltic Ambition uh, until 1507, giving us plus 10% trade efficiency. Was that from my, um, whatever it's called, quest mission thing? Possibly. I'm not entirely sure what you mean, but possibly. Uh, <laughs> isn't there, there's a thing I picked at the beginning that is similar to an ambition in CK2 that was to take Lubeck, Danzig, and Neva. Cool. Uh, and yes. I, and I don't know what that's called. No, me neither. But it sounds entirely plausible. <laughs> is there <laughs> no Sorry. Is, is there no thing that, that you pick that's like a kind of mission thing that gives you benefits? We've com oh, yes. it's called a mission. We've completed yeah, a mission. Yeah, it's called a mission. Yes. But I, I, did, I don't know what the specific mission you refer to is. It's all I no, no, no. I'm not asking what. I know it's ah, right, Baltic sorry. ambition. I'm asking where I find my missions. Yeah, it's all right. It is indeed on missions and decisions. Missions and decisions. Okay. Uh, missions and decisions. There we go. Okay. Um, so I have no current mission, so I might as well pick one now. Um, Good. So increase prestige, solidify our papal relations, and protect against England. That's it, really. Um. Papal relations is not a bad one, because you can just set set a um, diplomat on papal state and leave it. And you All right. Get a bonus. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fair enough. Okay, let's do that. Uh, request for military access from Dithmarschen. Why would I want to give them military access? Don't know. They're fighting Mecklenburg and saxe lauenburg That's why they want it. Is there any particular no reason. reason to say no? No, there's also no particular reason to say yes. I'll they're, probably not, they're probably not going to get annexed. Okay. Um, right, so now Lubeck has gone. Is there any more fighting I need to do down here? No, because I'm sieging Magdeburg and Norway okay. sieging then Hamburg. Then I will uh, march Is my what way Sweden up. doing? I've got no idea. They're in Lithuania. What? They're marching south. Uh, yeah, they're marching south in, through Lithuania. They're moving into Mogliev. I can only assume it's because of forts that I just can't find a way. Yeah, around. okay. I'm going to set them to go to <laughs> Latgalia, where they can just march to from there. So that is my priority for them now. Yes, there they go. <laughs> well done. Well done, Sweden. Um, okay, where's my... 
Hamburg have insulted us. Maybe not wise. Yeah, it may not be wise. May not be wise. Uh, okay, do you reckon I should try and get Bremen out now? Um, in terms of annexing it? No, 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 in terms of... Because you oh, I, I could to piece them out. Yeah, try, you could try it. See if I, they'll give me all their money or whatever. So transfer trade power is one of the things... They will now give me war reparations and transfer trade power. Yeah, then get transfer trade power, war reparations, and all their money. Yep, they will do that. Yep, go for it then. Nice. That means we get some more money, and your 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 income will also increase. My oh, and, and now Utrecht has been taken, so you can probably peace out with them as well. Yeah. Uh, where the hell's Utrecht? That is in the Netherlands. Oh, okay. Of course it is. Yes. I'll just click around until I there it is. Although, oh, mm -hmm. it would. Can you give it to me? I don't know. Can I give it to you? You may not be able to. But if not, you can probably give it to one of my vast subjects, and they have claims on it. Okay then. So should I continue the war against them? Uh, well, we've just defeated Utrecht, so ask them if you can All right, okay. give them the territory. Diplomacy, super peace. Um, so, so presumably, would they have to cede it to me? Uh, no, they oh, cede yeah, it to me. Oh yeah, Utrecht becomes a part of Burgundy. They yeah. will not accept that. Okay. Not even that on its own. Okay, then we'll, leave, we'll wait until uh, Magdeburg and Riga siege down. Okay. This might be my first expansion for 30 years if we can get it, so... Yeah, no, that's fine. I am fine helping you out. Then we can wait. I'm losing some uh, claims here, but uh, I'm too intent on doing things at the moment. So. It doesn't matter, it's just a matter of time now. Um, what other... I remember you flagging a particularly good a good other spot for a marketplace that, after I put, built one in Danzig. Um, Novgorod, Stalend, Riga, okay. Nevers, sorry, Neva, Lubeck. Lubeck's a good place for a marketplace. Yes, it already has a marketplace. Oh. Shayland, you're getting a marketplace. Lucky you! Come on, guys. Let's get ourselves over. Oh, they've taken gold. Okay. Uh, I do not understand the temperature at the moment. Decline. No, it's a bit weird, isn't it? Because it's been I really warm here, and now it's not really warm here, and, uh... Oh, God, I need to, uh, call Lubeck. Yes, you should probably do that. Yes, I'm doing it now. And then once it's called, you can probably give them to the burgers as well. Or, get more or Liebeck, as I call it. Liebeck. And you're now thoroughly dominating in the Lubeck trade node as well. Good. Unsurprisingly, having taken Lubeck out. Yes, I'm making money at war, which is a new experience for me. But a very welcome one. Indeed. Slowly getting my troops over there. I had to. I probably could have done it straight over there, but. Um, where Norway just stopped besieging Hamburg. They left. There it is. What can I say? So difficult to get good vassals nowadays. It is. What numpties?
Well, I'm just going to go and try and take it myself then. Oh no, I can't reach for some reason. Come on, core faster. Let's move fairly fast. 2nd of March, 1496, oh god. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Right, so you. Let's take my cop provinces back on the way. And let's blockade. Okay, well, Norway are blockading there at the moment. But that's no guarantee they'll carry on blockading. And they're only doing 70% of a blockade. Okay. Oh. And Riga has more ships, so they can defeat okay. Norway. I'll we'll go in there then, and then they can bugger off and do something else. Take back Mittau, march on Riga. And this whole sorry affair will be behind us. I would imagine. I hope so. I'm going to set Hamburg as an objective for Norway. I've set it as an objective for one of my vassals, and they're only, coming, and they're only going over now. Tax to my army. They weren't doing it from their own. Not particularly helpful. Right, Riga. Which apparently I can't march into. Oh no, there we go. Weird. Random Ravensburg army hopping around? Yeah, it was at war, the Ottomans. That, I mean, that clearly explains Ravensburg. everything. Oh, that's where their anyway. army is. That's a weird choice of places to be conquering, mate. Can I set an enemy army as, a tar as an objective? No. No, oh, that's a shame. Peace offer from Utrecht again. You might even oh. want to split your army in Riga, just so you don't take as much attrition. Uh, yes. Uh, ah, Utrecht will now cede themselves to you. Oh, excellent! And give us give all their money as well, obviously. Obviously. Good. Uh, yes, they will. Then let's do that. Let's do that. Presumably, as the allies disappear, the percentage my percentage gets higher as well. I would imagine. Well, it might even go down slightly because you, oh. you're no longer defeating an ally. Okay. That makes sense. okay. And I gained quite a lot of aggressive expansion for that, but that's okay because I'm not going to war with anyone else. Split in half, and I will send my. Oh, I don't know where their army is. It is in Poland. Oh, it's being Sweden th is killing. It's being it. thrashed by Sweden. Okay, oh, and, well, Ma and Magdeburg um, is now. Uh, you know what I mean. Magdeburg is now defeated, so you can ask them for all their money too, and yep. war reparations and trade. Just ask them for everything. Uh, Magdeburg diplomacy. Ooh, I have poor government policies, apparently. Uh, lose one stability or lose 66 tickets. Uh, oh, my stability's down to one again. I'm going to lose the money. Super peace. Magdeburg. Can't be taken. Uh, so, transfer trade power. War reparations. All your money. Yep. All 13 of it. Okay. 13. Yeah. Dismal. You're going to be much richer for the next decade than you will be for a long time after it. Just yeah. because of all this trade power and war operations you're getting. Okay, even if I don't have anything else to do with my split army, is it? are they still worth being split? Yeah, just so, so okay. they're not getting attrition. That's fine. What are you doing, Flanders? Why are you over there? I set your... Sorry, Holland. I set your war goal in Hamburg. How can we be at 19%? It, don't. It's, just don't think of it like that. But don't think <laughs> of it like percentages. I know it says percent. It doesn't mean percent. It's 70%. Okay. There's a maximum possible of a 100% war score. But that doesn't mean you're only 19% winning. Good lord, I'm getting plus 10 a month now. Good. good All these war operations and extra trade. But it is a double whammy on them. They have to give up 10% of their income to you, and they have to lose half of their trade power. Yeah, yeah. All of that. It's just... 
Brutal. And I'm on quite a lot of money now. That's nice. Let's build some more stuff. So I've got some separatists slowly climbing. Come on, sometimes this pop-up is really unreliable. Oh, okay, I'm going to have a revolt in Novgorod in about a year. And in Livonia in three. Estonia in three. Well, hopefully we'll win by then. Yeah. Just have to see. If not, there's plenty of armies wandering around that yes. are friendly. Um, it, it, oh no! It's a harsh life in the ocean. Loads of our sailors have joined the navy expecting exciting life, but it's been too hard. Lose 97 sailors. 97. 97. I don't use my ships or anything at the moment either, so it's hardly a travesty. But after I take Riga, there's nothing else to do because they don't even have any armies left. So. Um, we have to wait until we besiege Hamburg. Oh, okay. I mean, we don't have to, but it seems sensible to do so. Yeah, okay. You might... It would be very... It might be quite dangerous. It would be very dangerous, okay. Okay. <laughs> you could take Hamburg in this war, but everyone in the Holy Roman Empire... No, 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 no. I'm fine, I'm fine. We have to wait a while anyway, because I have to call Lubeck. And that's not going to happen for another two years, almost. Yeah, it's going to be a long time before I... Bes core Utrecht as well. It's going to be 29th of January, 1497. Yeah, I'm going to get some rebellions by then, but that's fine. It's fine. Okay, Riga's in positive now. Now, normally what I'd do because my vassals had claims on Utrecht, I would have asked to give the provinces to my vassals. However, I've had issues in the past where I've given land to my subjects. The emperor has asked for it back and they've said, oh, okay. <laughs> so I don't do that anymore in the Holy Roman Empire. Hmm. Marketplace in Neva, please. And in Novgorod. Um, <clears throat> come on, give me Riga. Not that that's the thing we're racing against at all, being as we start to take Hamburg and core things. Will we need you to core Utrecht as well? I don't need to, but I would prefer to. Okay. But I don't need to. I can just say, go away, Austria. Yeah, it's it's already... These, these rebellions are... Uh... But... Uh, it, it actually doesn't matter, because as soon as you I... Can... Yeah, as soon as I take Riga, my army's free and I can just march up and smack them. Yes, the Novgorodians are uh, almost there now. But it's fine. As soon as Riga's done, I can... And what are they going to do? Take Novgorod. It's Boom. a fort anyway, isn't it? If I remember correctly. Yeah, it's a fort, yeah. I and wish there was a... And we've won Riga. Excellent. And that means they're now trying to flee with their, with their fleet, which means they're going to get butchered. 61%. But what else could we do? Oh, well, Hamburg. Yeah, okay. I now have to get asked for diplomatic for access to about six states to get my land troops home. Oh. How is Hamburg doing? 21%. Merge my army again. Get ourselves there. Move my army to Neva. Oh, I can invest in a new idea. But should I save for tech now? What do you reckon? Well, yeah, because, yeah, my. Yeah, because my tech, my diplo tech is only at five, so. Yeah, I mean mine's only at six, so, but I would try and get it back up. Yeah, I'll get Some it. of our, ri our rivals, are, well, France is seven eight seven, so. Yeah. A cardinal. A cardinal. 
Do I want a cardinal in the administration? No. Probably not. Just getting prestige. Ooh, so presumably once my once the rebels actually take a territory, I can send my ally armies down there as well. Yes. Ah. It's a shame you can't target armies. Yes, it is. Because that would be something that would be done as well. Well, like, I think you're putting a bit too much faith. There's a massive rebel uprising, or there's the army of Riga, Sweden. Deal with it. Is what I'd say. Yes. In exactly those words. Yes. Pretty much. Ooh. Lots of flags. Nothing particularly particularly gruesome. How's Hamburg doing? 21%. Uh. I'm going to put up the speed. My army is in... Neva. And Hamburg is one. Okay. So, but we don't want to peace out yet. Or well, we want to peace. We can peace Hamburg out. Ah, okay. Let's do that then. Let's see what these guys will accept. Money. Uh, I can give you Hamburg. Uh, I I don't want Hamburg because I, I think you'll <laughs> I want it. Don't want Hamburg. Hamburg. Well, I think it'd be better for it to go to you. I I can't take Hamburg. Well, no, not right now, but I mean eventually. Yeah. Okay. Well, we actually won't... could could you vassalize Hamburg? I don't know. Let's find out. Where is that under? Yes. Where, where is it under? Somewhere. I can't negotiate any anything. Okay, Ooh. so it's not under seed provinces. It's might it's be not un under annul treaties. It might be under just treaties. Far uh, right. It's not. It's not an option there anyway. Oh, um, I have an idea. Let me switch the control to you. That might help. Occupied by Denmark. Try now. Might have close the war screen and go back in. Okay. Uh, let me see. So peace. Nope. I get enforce fleet basing. Enforce military access, give up claims in Denmark, transfer trade power, and war reparations. Those are the only things. Hmm. How odd. Oh, I think this type of war might not allow... No, that can't be right. I don't know. Okay. Well, anyway. Transfer trade power, war reparations, and money. money. There you go. We've made a killing on this war. God, we must have made a thousand ducats each, just from the generous donations. Yes. <laughs> I don't know why I said yes. 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 Novgorod, you scum. Right, let's brutally slaughter these guys. Hopefully. They have handed us a ass before. But they're not going to this time. No, I need to. On a long snaking journey home. Ugh. Right, that's that done. Back to Neva. Uh, but we have got Livonian and Estonian separatists arising sometime soon. Well, if I remember rightly, their their armies are smaller. So Quite possibly. Let's go deal with that. How's that coring doing? Getting there. Getting there slowly. 1496, March. Okay, not too far away. Expiring Cassus Belly on Hamburg. Oh no, what a shame. Uh, let my army build up a back. Wow, that manpower rocketed back up. Nice one. Go to Narva. I want you over there. In advance of the uprising. Huh. I now have Hanoverian separatists. Which is presumably linked to Lubeck. Mm. Independence yeah, for Hanover. So. 
Yeah, Westphalian culture, which is them. Okay, yeah. And Fraticelli heretics. Well, those those Fraticellis. Quite. I, I need I say no more Ooh, anymore. Events cardinal across the border. Uh, sometimes we have the chance to set something in mo into motion without seeming to have done anything. One such chance has arrived recently when a cardinal living on the soil of one of our neighbours admitted to an agent from Denmark that he would consider moving across the border and support us in the Curia for a price. While this may be tempting, there may be a greater price to pay if we take advantage of this. The wrath of the country he deserts. Um, so I could lose a little bit of money, gain 50.5 corruption... I should point out I'm currently at 4.4. Um, Holstein will be the seat of a new cardinal. Hamburg will no longer be... Okay, I'll piss off Hamburg. I really don't care about yeah, pissing don't... off Hamburg. And the, or the other one, the other thing is gain Spymaster. That's just um, someone you can recruit. It's not... All right, okay. I'm totally taking that cardinal. More cardinal action. Cardinal action being my favourite historical cardinal. You heard me. I heard you. I just I'm in stunned silence, basically. <laughs> right, you can go back to hunting pirates. Your your calling in life. Do I need to wait until I double core Lubeck or? Uh, I think just need a single core. Okay. Ooh, I can get military tech. Excellent. Enables large cast bronze mortar and hoof niece. Well, you all need a good hoof niece. So I, I've always thought that a hoof niece is pretty much... Yeah... Required. Um, spend 240 ducats or nearly for 10 loyalty from the nobility estate huh. or lose one stability um. and I'm at stability one at the moment I, uh, it's up to you yeah. oh God, I've got money. multiple events it's quite a lot of money isn't it how much does stability cost to, to bring up admin again? plus your corruption factor what it brings up corruption the corruption brings up the cost of pretty much everything, I think. All oh, right, I see. Uh, where is my stability and expansion thing? Da, 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 da. 170. It'll cost me. Ugh. Right, I'm going to pay him off. Yeah. Fine. Uh, okay, Lubeck is considered part of my thing. I also have support the Florentine school. Uh, we're in a position to support the Italian artists in the Florentine school. Um, so, lose 130 ducats, 10 diplo power, 30 administrative power, and gain plus one yearly prestige. For how long? Um, uh, 40 years. That is quite good. Uh, or lose five prestige. Okay, what well, yeah. you think is good, I'm going to do it. Uh, right, I think I just got double, double rebellioned, but, um, well, maybe not. Yeah, um, these guys are just 12k. And they're on a fort of yours. And yeah, they're, they're nothing. And their generals work much worse than yours. You're nothing, do you hear me? Yeah, yeah. they're down. Quite, quite rapidly. Yes. And they have it a single be, cannon. It would be good if, um, like, defeating one rebel army reduced your general. Hmm. I know what you mean. Like, like, oh, we, yeah, we shouldn't, <laughs> because, yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, because that would be. I managed to figure it out the, from the from the clues of the context of what I said. Right, I, I've double cored Lubeck because it was I'm, cheap. I'm apparently in a at a jousting tournament, so I've managed to gain a, a general who is three three six three. Wow. Now six maneuver is not very useful, but still. Much better than nothing. Nice. Um, right, so I, I've called... Uh... I, I need until January 19... Well, basically six months. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Um, <laughs> bizarrely, I could probably take my army maintenance down. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh... I, I have 
I'm only not dropped mine because of Utrecht Rebellions, but I have dropped all my forts down. I think I... Uh... Oh no, I've still got Livonian Separatists, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. France has declared war upon England. They cite Reconquest as their cast of spelling. Reconquest of what? Oh! England still has the boar. Okay, this could be interesting. Uh, okay. Yeah, Livonia's gonna rebel any second now, so. Oh, if only Bohemia would Call come for in. peace, monthly oh. war exhaustion. Yeah, fuck it. It's only four more months of war to go, guys. Don't get cold feet now. Yeah, it's probably worth waiting. Other than what get... are you, pacifists? Unwilling to cause untold nuclear Misery. genocide? You'll never be a politician. Not in Britain, anyway. Not with that attitude. God, that's depressing. That's, uh, that's satire for any of you not paying attention to British goes politics. goes to that level. <laughs> that's sarcasm for uh, those of you not paying attention to British politics. Um, yeah. Oh, I can get a new idea, though. Do you have a diplomat spare, by the way? Oh, no. We'll do I have need... a diplomat spare? I do have a diplomat spare. We will need one in 29th of January. Okay. Wh who with? You, uh, whoever it is, Riga. To end the war. So that's when I'll be ready. All oh, right. Oh, yes. Oh, I see. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Finish Although I do need to 29th. send someone to the Pope at some point soon because I have that quest. But... Yeah, but the, the missions don't really expire. So it's okay. No, no, no. It's, uh... Duke Louis I is now infertile. <laughs> Which is fortunate he's already had a daughter. It is fortunate. Are we good to go? 29th. Oh, 29th. 0 0.5, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, 0 0.8, 0 0.9. Go. We got it? Well, actually, it's 100.0%. Okay. But I'm sure I can survive another day. You no, you know what? Let's, let's, tick it. let's tick it a couple of days just to be sure. We'll oh, kick yeah. ourselves. Okay. Utrecht is now part of our patrimony. We'll defend so. it to the last drop of peasant blood. Riga! Super peace or unconditional surrender. Uh, super peace, I assume. And in uh, fact, it is such a wealthy province, Utrecht, that it's worth making a state just for Utrecht. Um, yeah, I was going to say with Lubeck, although it might be part of other ones now. I'm not... No, no, it wasn't. And it, it yeah. was definitely worth doing that. Um, so, Riga to me, please. And then money. Uh, and money. then... Yes, lots of money, I assume. Oh, it's only 279. But that's it, isn't it? There's nothing else yeah. I can do. So. Just make sure you mouse over to the left to make sure you don't have any You shouldn't. But just in case. Mouse over to the left? Yeah, where the aggressive expansion icon is. Alright, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, 21 aggressive expansion. Um, but no one will join, so that's fine. I didn't think yeah. anyone would, but it's just worth making sure. Yeah. Okay, send fine. And then the only thing... And in fact, whilst you're at it, you, you might as well accept peace with Riga and then immediately go to war with... Livonian order, just so you could, just mainly so that Danish take, Baltic to take the Leafland. Yeah, mainly so that okay. Danish Baltic fits nice okay. on the map. You can unpause, by the way. Oh, so can, can you not? No. Nope. I pause it. Oh. So, I wish it be. Ooh, and got some more de do uh, Well, you know what? I'll wait for the Livonian uprising first. Yeah, that's pretty sensible. I have a Utrechtian separatist uprising in six years. Oh, I can start annexing. <laughs> Excellent. I will annex. Yeah, sorry, integrate you, Brabant. How am I earning less money than when I, <laughs> when I was at war? It's fine. It's fine. Uh, okay. Someone... Taking Utrecht has put me back in the great powers list. Someone go talk to the Pope. How do we do that? How do I actually send someone to the Pope? Um, Papal State. All right, okay. What, so Rome is just owned by Papal State? Papal? Yep. Oh, oh, it actually was at this time, was it? Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh. Okay. Um, the Papal State grew to be very strong. They took life of in northern Italy. Fair enough. They were actually called the Papal States uh, over time because they become so disorganised that whilst they technically mm. held allegiance to the Pope, they there were lots of like 
petty rollers underneath them. Ah, God, stop sitting on 90%. Oh, God, it's going to be 1.5 years. Oh, well. What for? Until they rebel. Oh, well. Oh, well. Just can't trust the schedule of these filthy rebels. Yeah. Maybe I should just go to war with... Probably. Now. Yeah, all right. Because then, then you can just leave a, a token garrison there anyway. And oh, then I, just... can't, I can't declare war. Oh, I have no diplomats to send, that's why. That'd be why. Um, well, I'll tell you it's what, I'll tell you what, that, that sounds like a, a good end to the, yes. uh, to the thing. To the thing. The thing. Um, yeah, so uh, it's going pretty well here in uh, the Danish Empire. Uh, and hopefully I'll start integrating Norway and Sweden at some point soon as well. Um, yeah. In fact, you could probably start that now. Ooh, well, t like tell it. you what, we'll open, we'll open the next episode Indeed. with with talking about that. So thanks for watching. Let us know what you think of our EU4 stuff. Uh, any changes you think we could make that could make it more exciting? Uh, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you next time for more EU4. Goodbye. Bye.